Hi, this is episode 65 of my NO1800 Let's Play. All of it is recorded on stream on my main channel and episodes of it are gonna be uploaded every day here on my second channel. Hello. So, let's turn up the master volume and jump right into the game. I'm really happy today and also really happy to be playing the game because last time I finally defeated the idiot that was that Spanish guy nothing against Spaniards but he was like incredibly annoying and now he's gone and the only person left is some German who is way weaker than me and like technically we're in war with him but every time our ceasefire ends he just wants to extend it so practically we're at peace it's like the the Korea situation but also I'm kind of losing money or at least I'm like around zero so I'm not making any significant money I am oh I am in the new world I just destroyed stuff in the new world new and that's honestly where I should stay with some ships uh, because that's the main way of progressing for me right now I think is to just make more people exist in the new world so let's take one ship and pick up these things and then I can see I don't I don't think any of these really have resources though not not wants to make a civilization so I will take all of them and send them back to the old world and in the old world I'll take a ship and send it back here and then start settling on an island maybe I'm gonna take take Pena Pequena I know I know I'm gonna work on that is that my ship no it's the pirate's ship maybe now this one is small this one is really big Porto do Sol is that the one I had originally no it's not I don't think it is I think this one this one is also big Porto Trista no Porto Trista um I'll just see I'll just I, I'll settle on all of them eventually anyway so I'll just take one for the start I also have a quest here I don't think I wanna do that it's not too important at the moment so let's go to the old world let's see if I have any ships anywhere uh, yeah some are somewhere here a oh, it, oh I can see on the map where they are I think there are some here in the haven, yeah. So I can get them timber. I can, wh what else do I need? I think I need steel beams. And I need something else to build a trading post. I think if I scroll through it, I might realize what it was. Or was it just these two things? Uh, I think it might have been just those two. I, I can't see anything else that would be important right now. I don't need normal wood. Don't need clay. Don't need bricks. I think it was just those two. Let's just take more timber with me then. And let's get the ship to another region. Specifically the old world. Uh, the, the new world, sorry. This is the old one. Which island was a good one? I think I'll just take the closest one that's big, which is this one. Pordosol. So I'll go back and I'll send it to Porto Sol. Also, I think throughout the last few minutes you've been able to see that my profits like sometimes they're a little bit below zero and sometimes they're a little bit above zero. On average, I think I'm losing money, but not a lot. But that's also gonna change. So Porto Sol, let's send it there. And that will take a while. In the meantime, I'll take all the other ships or Let's not take all the other ships, I'll need some in the new world, but most of the other ships like I'll I'll just let I'll just let these stay here. And with these stations Yeah, a few more can stay. I have way too many ships anyway. I'll just send all of these back home to Broken Butterfly, my main island. So that will happen in the background. Both of those traveling. And what I have to do now is actually progress in the game again. Now that I finally deleted my worst enemy, for which Life I need to like get the important I stuff. I need sewing machines, I need canned food and I need bread and also beer. 
So the first thing to fix is definitely beer. I already had trade routes set up. So... Um, the beer one has ships that are destroyed. But I think you can add new ships to it. The, oh, I, I don't know which of these are in the old world still. Because I would like to take one that's still there so that I had, the trade route can start more quickly. Otherwise I have to wait for them to come here. But if I look into the ship menu... And I can select some. I think the I'll take the Kraken's Core 2 and the Dauntless 2. I hope I remember those names. Kraken's Core 2 and Dauntless 2 was right below that. Some of your ships do not possess enough. Oh, oh, they both want to do this. Oh, that makes sense. So I'll, I'll remove this. And... I'll send them like this, I'll accept the change to it and this route should work again. The wood route still is working, that's good, I'll accept that. The Technoblade Never Dies route should also still be working. Oh wait, the ship, oh yeah, this ship has been destroyed. So I can take a new one to assign it there, although I, once again, have to go back into the ship's menu. The, Br the Brilliant 2 and the Kingfisher 2. I think basically all of my ships are twos now because the ones have all been destroyed and there's only so many names the game has saved. Kingfisher 2 was one of them, I actually only need one so that's gonna be fine. Um, so why, why, why is it called Sewing Machines Pro Loss? Is it... Is it from... It's Bristlewitch Lost Mill. So Loss is Lost Mill, why is it called Bro? Did I want to write Brav or Brazil? Just this island that kind of looks like Brazil. I think that might have been the case. In any... Yeah, anyway, I'll revamp that too. The Brilliant 2 was the other ship, so I'll take that one. And that route should work again. And then, what what does this one do? Nothing. I'll, I'll, I'll destroy that trade route if it does nothing. And bricks, where does bricks go? From it, it sends them from Brazil to Broken Butterfly for some reason only 20 and 50, even though it loads up 50 and 50. Am I making any? Am I making any bricks here? I don't think I am. I'm not making any bricks on this one, and I only have one clay deposit, so I'm not making any. And a ship I can take is the Hydra too, so I'll reactivate the bricks route. And also, you know, it's probably fine if I just remove this. And if I leave it like that, I'll, I'll make like 30. Because the trip from between these is really quick. So some should stay on the original island. Actually, I can calculate this. No, I can't because I don't know. I don't know how quick the trip is. So I, I could calculate it if, if I did. But I'll just I'll assign the Hydra 2 and I'll accept this. And now a lot of my trade routes should be working again. Let's see, let's look at what isn't working. Uh, I think we fixed beer, right? Beer and bread, we did fix that. Uh, yeah, bread. Did we fix can... Oh, uh, there's a ruin here. There are several ruins here. I have to make those normal buildings again. This is also one. Did I... What was I asking? Did I fix canned food and sewing machines? I think I did fix both of those things. Yeah, canned food and sewing machines. So everything in theory is should, should get to this island. The only question is if it's enough. But I can still always increase the amount of production and the amount of trading that's going on, the amount of trade routes. The only thing is I think I paused some... I paused some of my things, like here. I paused basically everything, except for this one cannery no space left here. and some of these farms. I'll, I'll not un unpause all of it, because that will have huge maintenance costs. I'll just leave it as it is for now, because it is making some... It's making some canned food. But if I don't, you know, I, I'll reactivate a little bit of it. How spontaneous. 
when do we start again? And another cattle farm. I honestly I don't wanna calculate how much I wanna I have to reactivate exactly. There's nothing going on in Shriver Toes. There's nothing going on in Bristle Witch. I mean yeah there is, but only for Bristle Witch itself. The fire left ruins behind. Or the Bristle Witch is making a lot of money, like two thousand an hour. While Broken Butterfly is actually losing money. Where the Oh. Oh wow. Oh yeah, there were riots here. Know a few what's turned to factory work. Oh, uh, there's a lot to fix on this island. I'll just have to go through that slowly, or at least not that quickly. Your city has grown more beautiful. Yeah, obviously now that there's no ruins. Thanks for telling me, though. Uh, I think was that all of them? Are there any ruins left? I don't think there are. I think I fixed all of the ruins. So I did that now. And I'll have to wait obviously for all the ships to go on their trade routes and deliver the stuff and then make my artisans more happy. At which point more of them will exist and they'll give me more money and I should stop losing it. Losing the money. I also want to buy back shares from Obersbach. Which is hugely important to me. But I don't have the influence for it. Although the influence should come with more people. So as I get more of those, I'll have more influence. Let's do a quest for now. I know you're busy, this looks fun. A, a construction quest. Build one fountain garden. 